Hi, it's Ian Prescott there for ECRHA TV. The Susquehanna Sports Center was host to the last foray of the 2011 portion of our season. Before we head into the runner break, here's some of the exciting action from Saturday night and Sunday afternoon. In a 5-3 Rowan win over West Point, with the Profs and the Black Knights looking to jockey themselves into the playoff hunt for the D1 Regional Championships before the semester break, the pace of Saturday's second feature game was a feverish one. Rowan was able to strike tw twice in nine seconds just after passing the halfway point of the first period from tallies from Brendan Scally and Alexander Schmidt. However, the West Point, uh, the West Point Black Knights were answered back with strikes from Jeffrey Lesmeister at the end of the first and Matthew Riopel halfway through the second. The teams would then trade goals until the steady hand of Rowan captain John Adams would net the game winner just 37 seconds after the Black Knight tied in the third. And the Profs would end the scoring in the second period with an insurance marker sealing the game 5-3. Kevin Sally earned his second win of the year. Here's some of the action. Five to three, Brockport win over Penn State. It's no lie that Brockport's former All Stars of Joe Chapius and Patrick Keys have struggled mightily this year. And with easy points so few and far between in a parity-filled D1 schedule like this, require marquee players to improve their own or to prove their own worth. Facing a 500 team in the Penn State Nittany Lions, led by star goaltender Mitch Reinhold, that would be no easy task. Riding a six-game ringless streak into the tilt. Suddenly, the switch turned on. Chapius, who was arguably the best player on the rink, engineered a two-point game with a goal and assist while Keyes stopped 24 shots on the way to crucial 5-3 golden equal victory. Here's some of the highlights. In a 10-1 Westchester route over the Temple Owls, Jonathan Lucente continued his assault on the ECRHA Division I ranks as he posted a tremendous 6.3 goal, 3 assist effort against the Temple Owls in the first feature game of the weekend. Jonathan wasn't alone as 6 of the 8 Westchester players managed to have a multi-point game. Goaltender Roman Chiokaze was also managed to keep his undefeated record intact as the Rams crushed their opponent 10-1. Luke Aaron of Temple had the lone Owl goal. Here are all the highlights.
about it here from ECRHA TV. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next semester in Feasaville for All-Star Weekend.